Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome to a video series that I haven't actually named yet. In this series I'll be explaining certain elements of Warframe for new and returning players. In this video we'll be talking about a recent addition to Warframe, Ayrton Sculptures and Ayrton Stars. So what are they? Ayrton Sculptures serve a couple of functions, they can be scrapped in exchange for large amounts of endo, used as decorations in your ship, alternatively you can also trade them with other players for other goods. Ayrton Stars on the other hand can be used to increase the endo value you get from scrapping sculptures. So where do you get them? You can get both sculptures and stars by playing regular missions. The sculptures are pretty rare, but you usually find them on the floor randomly. So far I've had a couple this way. The stars can also be found in regular missions too. These are definitely much more common. Keep an eye out for bright blue or amber spots on the ground. These appear in random locations, so check everywhere that you can. They're commonly found in containers, so break every single container that you come across, you may just find a few stars. You can also get sculptures and stars from a weekly quest held at Maru's Bazaar on Earth. Simply talk to Maru and choose the last option, and she will send you into the Aroken Derelict. Once you arrive in the Derelict, your goal is to complete a parkour room. When you've successfully completed the quest, you will find a sculpture waiting for you at the end. If you fail, don't worry, simply go back to the start again. This, admittedly, can get a little bit frustrating. Once again, make sure to break every container in this map as you can find a few stars in one level. Adding stars to your sculpture. Once you have a sculpture and some stars, you can finally start to add value. To do this, go to the mod section of your ship. Once there, click the item sculpture panel and you'll be presented with a menu showing you all of the sculptures that you've collected so far click on the one you wish to modify. Pay attention to the number in the bottom right, this tells you how much your sculpture is currently worth. Find an indentation, click it and you'll be asked if you wish to add a star. Pay attention to the number in the bottom right once again as this should be higher now. Hold left click and use your mouse to look around the sculpture and fill out any leftover indents. Extracting endo. So by this point you should have a sculpture complete with stars, now we're ready to claim the endo. To do this, you want to head back to Maru's Bazaar, talk to Maru, and click Extract Endo from My Ayrton Items. Click a sculpture to add it to your cell pile and you'll see how much endo it's worth and how much it's going to cost you to extract. Click Cell and you're done. So that brings us to the end of this video about Ayrton Sculptures and Ayrton Stars. If you found this useful, please leave a comment below, and if you have any suggestions for other upcoming videos, please leave a comment about that too. Thank you for watching, I hope you enjoyed, and see you soon with some more videos.